So, ito na yung ating uh, second topic for vertical curve. Yung unsymmetrical curve. So, alam naman natin yung figure ng ano, di ba? Vertical curve. So, sabihin natin ano na lang. Summit curve. Summit curve yung example natin. Okay. So, ito yung ascending curve. Ay, uh, okay, dyan. Ito naman yung uh, descending. Okay. Then, this is uh, PVC and PVT. Okay. Yan. Then, this is PVI. So, dito, sa ating unsymmetrical curve, hindi na equal yung ating, ano, yung ating length of curve from PVC to PVI and PVI to PVT. So, meron na silang length 1 and length 2. So, ito nyan is magiging L1. Ito na nyan is L2. So, this total length is total length L. Okay? So, ito na yung mangyayari sa kanya. Hindi na kasi siya naka-mirror type. Okay? So, i-extend natin to. Hanggang dito sa PVT. Ayan. Then, ito, gradient 1 pa rin yan. So, ito yung ating gradient 1. Ito naman yung ating gradient 2. Then, natiin natin sa dalawa. Okay? So, ibig sabihin, dito nyan is maging ano. Ang length nito is L2. L2 multiplied by G1. Tama ba? Ito naman, L2 multiplied by G2. Okay, ang total length natin, or total height, is, okay, L2 multiplied by G1 plus G2. Okay? Then ito, ito pa rin yung external distance H nya. Then, kapag kinalag atin yung PVC and PVT, H din to. So, same pa rin. Okay? So, by ratio proportion, 2H over L1 is equals to total height na L2 multiplied by G1 plus G2 over L1 plus L2. Ibig sabihin ng ating uh, H is equals to L1 multiplied by L2 multiplied by G1 plus G2 over 2 multiplied by L1 plus L2. Yan. So, ito na yung ating H ngayon. Okay? Ngayon, kung meron tayong point dito, from PVC to PVI, sabi ito yung ito, point 1. Then, this is Y1. Then, ang distance niya from PVC is yung X1. Okay? Then, kung meron naman tayong point dito, this is Y2. Ang distance niya from PVT is X2. So, gagamit para tayong square uh, property of parabola. So, ito nyan is y1 over x1 squared is equals to h over l1 squared. Okay? Then, ganun din sa y2. Over x2 squared is equals to h over l2 squared. Next. Yun ang mga ano natin, location of highest point or lowest point. Sabihin natin ito yung ating HP or LP. Then sabihin natin ang distance niya from PVC is S. Then ang distance na to from PVT is L minus S. So meron tayong condition dito. Okay, first condition, when... H is greater than G1 multiplied by L1 over 2. Yung location ng S natin, ng ating HP or L, LP is S is equals to G, G1 multiplied by L1 squared over 2H. Okay? Kapag ang ating H daw is greater than sa G1 multiplied by L1 over 2. Then ito nyan, from PVC. Okay? Second condition, when H is less than G1 multiplied by L1 over 2, yung S natin ngayon is magiging G2 multiplied by L2 squared over 2H. So, nasa G2 na siya or gradient 2. Ibig sabihin, ito nyan is magmumula na sa PVT. Okay?
So, yun yung ating condition para sa location ng ating uh, highest point or lowest point. Okay, so, ito yung introduction ng ating unsymmetrical curve. So, example na tayo. <coughs> 